Apparently the COVID vaccine has minimal side effects, but doctors say that everyone's immune system reacts differently. And as 7 News' Kimberly Brown explains, some side effects may affect the outcome of another life-saving preventative care measure, mammograms. While many women scheduled their annual mammograms, the onset of COVID-19 has getting the vaccine a priority. But doctors say getting that shot will have them looking at your mammogram a little closer. Mammograms and the COVID vaccine are both meant to save lives, but together they're causing doctors to take a second look at swollen lymph nodes. And normally swollen lymph nodes can be a sign that your body's normally producing immune response to whatever you're reacting to. Dr. Pavani Shah is board certified in diagnostic radiology and studies breast exams. The medical community noticed the pattern of swollen lymph nodes after patients got the COVID vaccine. So it's usually a good thing to have that response after a vaccine, but in our case, whenever we see swollen lymph nodes on a mammogram, we're always suspicious that something could be happening in the breast. Swollen lymph nodes are not unusual. They're located throughout the body, in your neck, under your arms, and even in the groin area. If it's inflamed, the area will be tender to the touch. Doctors say under normal circumstances, swelling could mean that your body is fighting an infection or there's inflammation. A majority of people I don't think will have swollen lymph nodes from what we've seen so far. When a vaccine of any kind is introduced into the body, lymph nodes create antibodies to develop a good immune response. This new development is prompting new guidelines. So we suggest that if you got a COVID vaccine, um, we try to ask you to wait four to six weeks after that vaccine to get your screening mammogram. That way it'll give your body time to react to that vaccine, but those lymph nodes hopefully will go back down. Doctors say if you develop swollen lymph nodes after getting the vaccine, there's no need to worry. It's just your body responding. However, if that tenderness persists, you should reach out to your doctor. Reporting from Greenville, Kimberly Brown, 7 News. And doctors say if you've received the vaccine and are concerned about an area in your breast, do schedule your mammogram anyway and make them aware of your timeline.